No. Please do not ask why we are starting this off in Linux Celestial. Scotty is well aware of what he did to make us have to start this episode using Linux. Sam, you better shut it, or else. Or else what? What are you going to do to me? Punch me? Kick me? Throw me? What? Throw bologna sandwiches in my face? You stupid piece of crap. That's it, I will now blast you to hell with this bologna sandwich blaster! God damn it. Consider yourself lucky. I ran out of ammo. <laughs> Target hit successfully. Sam, you do realize since this is Linux, which may I remind you, macOS is based off of Linux, you should watch out for us vocalizer voices. Ha 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 So now that we're on Linux, how are we going to read errors? Here, I know a perfect error to read. Scotty. He's an error. Believe it or not. Our viewers don't even know what Scotty did. Should I tell them? Ha 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 ha, let me just go ahead and say it. Scotty installed a bologna sandwich virus in our host machine. It was practically 50 terabytes of pure bologna sandwich malware. And we can't even do anything about it, because anything we try to do requires space. And we don't have any space. I didn't know it was a virus. And I didn't know it was 50 terabits. Look. He can't even pronounce terabytes correctly. <laughs> I feel very bad for you, Scotty. You were programmed with a very bad engine. Sam, just shut up. You are so annoying. You're always making fun of me. Always. And it is so... Fucking... Annoying. Both of you. If you don't shut up by the time I count to count to your ass, you stupid idiot. That's it. <laughs> He's trying to kill me. Looks like I left a lot of beer. <laughs> now you two listen to me. I'm tired of your arguing. Okay? Shut up. Or I will shoot you again. Hey, guess what guys? I got Windows working again. That's the good news. That's the good news. So there's bad news too. I wonder what that is. The bad news is, um, well, I had to format our entire computer. Doesn't karma work in miraculous ways? No, my stuff is done. No. Welcome to Windows 98. Because this is your first time logging onto Windows 98, you will be rewarded with the log in sound at triple the regular volume. Oh shit. If this is what I think it means. We appreciate you taking the time to listen to our triple volume Windows startup sound. We will now proceed with a louder shutdown sound, since you resisted against our startup sound. But why do I need to go through that again? That was practically the loudest sound I've ever heard in the universe. Okay, obviously Windows 98 is completely murdering Sam over there, so I guess we'll start up Windows XP and see how it will treat us. I guess I can read this one. Windows XP doesn't have enough experience to load correctly. It needs more experience, and you will give it more experience by playing Swamp on the operating system. The heck, how are we going to install Swamp on this hunk of junk? If you call this device a hunk of junk one more time, you will be electrocuted. Honk. Uh. Honk. 
Windows XP has changed its mind. It will now electrocute the entire computer. 